Hey you guys, it's your girl Deja Jordan. So today I wanna teach you how to achieve a very flawless foundation base for when you get ready to do your um, your eyeshadow. It's primer, um, it prevents shine, and then I am using the Lancome um, foundation. I totally forgot the color, but I'll link it in the description box down below. So I go ahead and put all of the foundation on in the primer. Yes, of course. And then I like to use my beauty blender and to just make sure I work the product into my skin. For me, it seems to come out a whole lot smoother. Um, I like it. There's no like harsh lines or anything like that. You can't see the circles from a brush. So a beauty blender or any type of blender is the best, I think, when it comes to applying foundation. So I want to work all of the foundation into my skin. Tando, tando. Who's After I finish working in the foundation, I want to go ahead and use my Tarte um, concealer and I just want to um, pretty much highlight everywhere I want to do the under my eyes, you know, my normal spots, the bridge of my nose, of course, because I just want all of that to pop out. And I want to do a little bit of my forehead. Um, the above my lip, some people call it like the cubist bowl or something like that, but I also want to do the chin. And I'm going to go back in with that beauty blender and I'm just going to pat um, and work it into my skin. So I do not like to go all the way to like the ends of my face because I feel like it takes off, well not off, but it does, it, I don't need to highlight all the way on the side of my face pretty much. So I like to take the butt of the beauty blender and to just work it literally right there by my eye. I think it looks crazy when it looks like I got a damn mask, or sorry, it looks like I got a dang bat mask on, you know? So it's just kind of, I want to keep it to a minimum, but I like to take the concealer and put it on my eyes too because I am getting myself ready to apply my eyeshadow.
going in with my Iman foundation stick. This is kind of what I like to use to contour. I want to go on the sides of my nose. I don't like to go up too high with it because I'm gonna blend it, but yeah. So I wanna do it on each side and then the front of my nose just so that it gives it that cute little shape. And then I take my beauty blender and just press that into my skin. It gives this a flawless look, you guys. I promise that whole brush using the brush I might have to stop doing that because this beauty blender is giving me so much life right now. <laughs> that into my skin I like to use the butt of the beauty blender because it makes the product spread so I don't have to um, overuse any products on my face and it just gives it a flawless look because I want it to look more chunkier at the top and then just kind of complement the the frame or the structure whatever you want to call it of my face so I don't want to overdo it I still want it to look completely natural but I want you to be like dang she got some cheekbones on her like they look good. <laughs> <laughs> banana but that's just me so I'm gonna go ahead and pop that underneath my eyes just so that um it kind of sets everything is that what it is setting powder yeah so everywhere that I just highlighted I want to go and put the powder there <laughs> Normally, I would let it sit while I go ahead and do some of my eyeshadow, but I decided to let it sit for about two to three minutes, and now I'm just gonna go ahead and wipe it all off. I like to use a nice little fluffy brush so that it just gets all the product off of my face. Well, the excess product, really. Who's my 
So now I'm just going to set my contouring. I am using the um, Kat Von D contouring palette. I like it. It's, it's still nice. Uh, I don't use it as often as I should or as I would like to. Maybe I should start using it a lot more often. But I do like the results that it's giving me today, you guys. I'm feeling it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm always laughing. I'm, uh, I think everything is funny. Really, that's just my personality. <laughs> totally turned off but I did spray my spray my face with some setting spray um, or finishing spray whatever you want to call it but um I did go ahead and spray my face with that and voila here is the finished look so um, if you guys enjoy what you saw here please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and follow me on all of my social networks, um, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. I don't be talking about nothing on Twitter, but yeah, go ahead, still follow me. Um, and let me know what you guys think. If there's some other videos that you want to see, please don't hesitate to leave in the comments down below what you want to see, and I will make it happen. <laughs>